a tragic discovery leads to an agonizing night of waiting for a Chicago family. A young woman has been found dead, and that family fears it could be their missing loved one. They suspect she is the latest victim in a string of disappearances that could be related. NBC 5's Michelle Relaford's on the story. She is live with the latest. Michelle? Allison, an excruciating night for the family of Shantaea Smith. A woman's body was discovered just blocks from the home where she was last seen, and they are praying it's not her. Chicago firefighters sawing into the garage where a body was discovered tonight, just two blocks from where 26-year-old Shantaea Smith was last seen. I just want this one to just go home. Do what I'm missing. We'll get this. I'm just praying. Earlier today, Smith's mother questioned 10th District Police about the status of the investigation. Smith was last seen on May 26th near West 16th Street and Central Park Avenue. I don't want to think the worst that somebody did something to my daughter right now. I'm trying to think good and positive things. Moore and other members of the Lawndale community are worried the disappearance is linked to others. Our biggest fear in the community is there's some type of predators loose. 18-year-old Amy Stanislawsik was last seen in the 3600 block of West Fillmore on March 16th. 15-year-old Sadaria Davis went missing April 27th from the 4200 block of West Adams. Her body was found in an abandoned building. All of them was in the same proximity. Uh, and, and all of them disappeared. Tonight, Smith's family frightened at the thought of her 7-year-old daughter never seeing her mom again. What can we say to her when she wants her mom, you know? What, how, how can we tell her? And police tell us that woman's body was discovered underneath a car inside that garage in the 1800 block of Central Park Avenue. Identification could come tomorrow. Michelle Rulliford, NBC5 News, back to you. All right, thank you, Michelle.